Hello everybody, I'm Big Mac Davis here, and welcome back to some more Golden Souls for the PC, played through GZ Doom on the normal difficulty setting. The crossover between Doom 2 and Super Mario 64, so I think we're in the final uh, map of the first part of the castle, if that makes any sense. Or the first part of the fortress, if that makes any sense. This is called Fall Weather Castle, and there are 45 monsters and 182 items, so let's get busy. So already this looks quite uh, delicious. I love the yellow and the uh, pink sky. And just mowing down everybody that comes in my way. This machine gun is really nice. What in the world? Who in the world is that? He's appearing and reappearing and shooting orbs at me. Let's take care of these Hell Knights first. And then we'll see what we have going here. Oh, I hear him. Something's going on here. Oh, he's dead. I want your coin. No. It's gone. Alright, so a new enemy. I don't know what that thing is, but it's kind of like... Almost reminds me of like the wizards from um, Heretic and Hexen. Oh, we have another one. Now I can grab your coin, thank you very much. They give us a lot of ammo, so might as well use some of it. There we go. Not too bad so far, but a little bit tricky. You do have to be mindful of where enemies are and their projectiles as well. Lots of rockets. Lots of tasty, delicious rockets. Um, okay, this lava looks like it hurts a lot. So I am going to save my game just on the rare chance that I die. Which is entirely possible, by the way. <laughs> Oh, the, oh, wow. Doom guy actually, it, it looks like he's grabbing a hold of this uh, mesh. Flower just can't barely reach me, so. Huh? Oh, get up there, Doom guy. Can you shimmy on over? Yes. Oh boy, a bunch of cacos. Let's uh, get down here. Um, does that submerge? Yes, it does submerge inside the water, so I'm gonna... I need to get closer to those cacos, so... Oh, I, I fell. Luckily, the lava doesn't kill you instantaneously, but I can't get up there. Oh, 
Dang it. I do not mean to fall off. Oh, let's just reload that. That was a pathetic attempt. Now, I'll come back for those coins that I missed. I just want to take care of these guys so they don't bother me. That's a lot of crushers, my goodness. Okay, yeah, I did miss a bunch of coins from the enemies, but uh, that's just the way it goes here. I think... Yeah, I think I know how to do this. didn't mean to submerge. Okay, is that all the coins? Yes, it is. Uh, do I want that medikit right now? No, I don't. Sounds like there's explosions going on around here. Okay, this is going to require precise timing. This is tricky. Oh, so something... something shot me. Oh, you stupid. Where are you? Thank you. Wow, I somehow got 67% health. Maybe when you kill them, they give you health? I'm not sure. Oh boy. More. Oh, <laughs> I just decided, hey, might as well try to go all the way here. It was a cacodemon orb. Or was that another one of those <clears throat> wizards? Something shot me. And I want to know who that was. Show yourself. We'll come back. Maybe we'll come back. Oh boy, yep. Bunch of rockets. Okay. Boy, my goodness. This is not going to be easy. <clears throat> Maybe I can just run across all in one go. Yes. Did it that way. Maybe I can do the same here. Jump! And then shimmy across. You had to jump there. Okay, so there's only a few coins left. Um... This is going to be difficult to do, but I think I can do it. I can get lucky. Very lucky. Nope. Gotta be more lucky than that. Either that or more skilled. Is there anything down here? <laughs> I'm just curious. No, I don't think so. And you can't get back up, so if you fall down, you're dead. Wow, this is... Is there a way to shut this down? Looks like there's that same mesh fence. But I can't shimmy across with those rockets. Well, we'll just keep trying. I'll try a couple times until I can get it. He's not jumping right away after 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 first jumping he's not jumping right away. Well, can I get these coins? Can I get them? there? Please let me up. Ugh. Ugh. I got all the coins, I just need to get out of here. There's no way up, is there? You gotta do it all in one go. I wonder though. Oh, it 
may be possible. <sighs> that last one is going to be tricky. Maybe I just have to jump. I jumped, but uh, nothing happened. We'll give it a couple more tries. There we go. Two coins remain. That's it. Wonder. I can probably easily just jump forward and jump back. Yep, just like that. Okay, one more coin remains. This one is going to be the toughest one, I think. There is no real easy way to get that. Hmm. That is going to be challenging. It's right in the middle of nowhere. Gotta be better than that. Gotta be better than that. Yeah, there, there's just no time. I might have to come back to that later. If there is a next time. I may have to come back later on. I don't want this to take too long. I mean, I do want to get everything. Like, all the kills especially, but... Well, they give us a lot of rockets here. How many rockets do I have? 33. I'm going to save those rockets. Whoa! Kako! I'm, I'm down here! his coin. I should have waited until he got closer, but... Oh well. Another Cacodemon. Wow. There goes the Cacodemon again. Let's use some rockets here. There we go. Just take care of the initial threat. Yeah, see, I already have full rockets, so it was good that I used some. What? Another Cacodemon! Wow, look how high up he is. Hello? I've been having problems with cacodemons lately. I must say, I do like the pyramid. Actually, they're, not, they're more like hills. They do look like pyramids, though. We'll take care of you while I wait for the cacodemon. There we go. Oh, wow. go. Are you going to come down now, or... Oh, I... Look at that little twinkle up there. I think that was a coin. It disappeared, though. He must have died. Let's go back. Grab up the remainder of... Well, I don't need... I gotta use the machine gun now. Okay. I'm going to save my game, because something may happen. Wow, I'm floating over an abyss. A literal yellow abyss. Did I get all the coins? Yes, I did. Let's jump. Jump. Oh, there's a big coin down there. probably fall off from that ledge over there. There we go. 
Anything else up here? Just the teleporter, so let's go ahead and drop down. Yep, we don't take any fall damage. That's a good thing. Oh, nice. It just takes you right back up here. How convenient. Oh. Maybe not very convenient. I thought it teleported you back up to that ledge, but we have to do this all over again. That's fine, though. I do like looking at the environment, though. Really, really well designed. And yes, people, I know what some of you people are thinking. Oh, he must be terrified right now of the heights. Yes, I'm trying not to think about it. Wow. Can you say... potential danger ahead? I think we certainly can. Okay, what's left in this map? We got four enemies left and a handful of coins as well. Let's, uh, save my game one more time. Um... Gigaka Koti Giga Cacodemon. That's what I would call it. Giga Cacodemon. Look how cute that is, though. But he wants me dead. He does have a health bar, which is always welcome. I love enemies that have health bars. Then you can just see how... How much, how much health they have left. Oh, wow. He's trying to dodge me now. And I'm trying to dodge him. Oh, boy. What's going on around here? I see a bunch of... Oh, he's good at dodging, that's for sure. Ouch. Something is getting me. Need more rockets, though. Why not? <laughs> do these orbs explode into... Yes, they do. I was wondering why there were Kakademon orbs after me. Oh, he's really dodging now. Boy, he won with 4% health remaining. That's not right. I should have totally had that. But he won fair and square. I got right in the way of his orb. This initial first part is not too bad. It's when he dodges that's just difficult. That's not gonna work. 9% health. Who's gonna work? He won again with 18% health. My gosh, this is... This is trickier than it looks, but I'm probably handling it. I have an idea. I have an idea. I can't fight him out in the open like this. Not with his orbs exploding into multiple Kakademon orbs. I think what I'm going to do when he hits 50% health, like right now, is just hide behind here. It's the best I can do. Maybe not. Maybe I just stink. Okay, 26%, 24, I 
hide from the orbs. Yeah. Fourteen percent health, come on. Let's finish it. That was a miss. Whoa! When he gets less than ten percent health, I think he just dodges even more. Well, maybe not. <laughs> bullets. He's dead. And there's my little golden soul. So I'm missing three enemies. I am going to go back and see if I can get them again. You got a golden soul. All right. So we got five golden souls so far. Now, let's see. Yep, we can go back. So, let's see what I missed. I don't think I can get up here. <clears throat> this looks kind of presumptuous. Is this... secret of any kind? No, probably not. This is a good place to go back and just get health and ammo, though. After that fight. I find using rockets up until 50% health works good, and then just snipe them off with bullets. So I'll, I'll save again. Yep, that's why I saved. Oh, stay up there. Yeah, there we go. Close enough. Oh, wow. That's a tough jump to make. Now, something shot me from here. I don't know what it was. It was one of the Cacodemon orbs, though. So... Yeah, see, something... Something's here. There is a Cacodemon. You can barely see his coins. Another one down there, though. Yeah, you see that mask moving down there? See that coin kind of flickering? It's a Cacodemon. Now I need some more health. Too bad I didn't... I'm going to go back and get that uh, medikit. Ah, I jumped! I jumped. Wow, I only gained 4% health, that whole thing. But, oh well. Such is life. Can't win them all. Okay, so I'm missing one enemy. That's all that's remaining. Any more cacos down here? I'm gonna save. You no, know, maybe not. But since there were cacos down there, maybe I can jump down here? No, there's nothing down here, though. I am gonna just jump down here. Cheese it a bit. Oh, yep, there's one more cacodemon, so. He's the last enemy. He's over this way. He died. There's his coin. But I won't be able to grab it, unfortunately. Now, about this coin. This is elusive to me. Wait a minute. I think I figured it out. I think I figured this out. get back up here. I grab the coin, but I don't think that's going to work because you have to actually jump off. Unless... Let me try it this way. Got to be better, though. Oh, 
Oh, you kidding me? I thought I grabbed a hold of the mesh. Hmm. Maybe that's not the way. I... I think I have it figured out. If I were to just jump... Yes! You can shimmy across there and then you just make a leap of faith over here. That's very tricky to get all the coins in that particular section, so... Okay, so I don't know if I'm missing any more coins around here. I probably am. But if you guys want to, you can uh, download this mod and play it along with me and point out to me if I'm missing anything. I'm gonna save. I didn't save yet. Is there a way to get beyond the wall up here? No, that just... I think that just... What is that? Loop around? Yeah. Okay. So... There's nothing down there. I've already been down there for that big coin. Nice place to stock up on all of your weapons. So... Oh, that's why they put this here. So that... See, you're supposed to teleport to the boss area, but I can't anymore. It's not allowing me. But this allows us to just come back out. So, let me make sure that's all the enemies dead. Um, 45, yep. I'm missing a handful of coins, but they're probably disappearing enemy coins. I don't know if you can get... I doubt you can get up there. Yeah. Okay, so Fall Weather Castle is done. We defeated the boss of this particular quadrant, who was the Giga Cacodemon. Very tough fight. Um, but now, I think I'm going to... Yes, hello, my good man. I'd like to purchase the Mega Armor again. For 120 coins. And... We'll save my coins. I just want to save. Maybe we'll buy the portable med kit eventually. So, that's it for this area. I think now it was this area next. Can this door be opened? Yes, it can. But we need six golden souls to open this door. So, the first level I'm going to play next is this one, which is Daring Desert. Oh boy, kind of like what, an Egyptian-themed one? I'm looking forward to it. So until then, I'm Big Mac Davis here, and I shall see you guys when I see you guys. So take care, everybody. Catch you next time.